LMG, sir. Easy, boy. How do things go? Nicely done. Good morning to you. Hello, ma'am. Anything. Please. You. Yes. Please. Coin. Please. Please. Uh, won't you lend a coin to a fella in need? Go get yourself something to eat. Sir. I want you to have this. Thanks, friend. It's nice to give something instead of just begging. I hate asking. Bonjour. All right, easy now. That you're a Diablo joke? Easy, old son. Fine morning, Carter. Ladies. Mister? Hello. Madam! Good morning, sir. I'm just in a friendly mood today for some reason. I'm pleased to hear ah. that. Bonjour. Are you well? Not good at all. Morning, to you. Good morning. Behind you, ma'am. Belle journée, n'est-ce pas? Don't think this day can get much worse. Je suis navré. One moment, please. This is extremely delicate. Hey. There. Oh, wonderful. May I help you? Well, uh, I don't know. I met you, remember? At that party? Oh, yes. You saved my life. Oh, I am eternally yours, Algernon Wasp, purveyor of the exotic and the exquisite, Enchanté. Uh, Tacitus Kilgore. How can I help you? May I interest you in a, uh, hat? Perhaps. Yeah. How about a nymph? I import them from Brussels. The idiots in this town all want Italian nymphs, but the Italians make the coarsest of marble. I mean, quite frankly, the Baroque is an abomination. Belgium. Now that is a land for the connoisseur. Oh, yes. Yeah, as I always say. But, you know, I'm not really a nymph kind of man. Oh, of course. Too ephemeral. You want something, uh, more tangible, more gothic. I also make corsets. Would you like a corset? I always wear one. Uh, no, I don't think so. Yeah, I ride a lot of horses. Um, the whalebone might stick in. Mm, well, a cup of tea. Uh, sure. And what is it you do, Mr. Kilgore? Are you a gentleman of leisure? An aesthete? <gasps> an artist. Uh, I suppose I'm <clears throat> kind of an adventurer. Ha! Huh. Yes, of course you are. Here, be careful with the china. Sir, it is French. Not Belgian? No, no, no. They are Philistines in that area not to be trusted. Youth, eternally preserved in marble is more their specialty. I fear China will always elude them. Now, why are you here exactly? I don't know. You're an adventurer, a wanderer, a lost soul cast out from heaven? <sighs> sure. Well, 
I do pay exceptionally well for certain objects needed for my art. Mm, you do? I do. Exceptionally well. Well, what do you need? Let's see. Right now, I have a couple of commissions. I need at least 15 egret plumes. Good ones, obviously. I also need 15 assorted orchids. Here's a list. Okay. I will see what I can do. Thanks for the tea. Thank you, Tacitus. It'll be very worth your while. How is it with you? I have seen better days. <clears throat> Mister? Morning. Hi there. There's your name. Howdy. Morning. Hello. Hello, sir. Hey, ma'am. Good morning. Hello, gentlemen. Bonjour. Mais bonjour. Go on, get going. Come on now, boy. Okay there, boy. Hi there. Bonjour, monsieur. You okay, boy? Here, boy. Hey. Yeah. Hi there. Lovely morning to you. You know when you have one of those days. Trim or something fancy like. Good. Now that isn't half bad, huh? All right, you're ready to go. All right. Bonjour, monsieur. The horse him. That fool can never remember to lock his barn door. nada me sorprende. Hello, ladies. Mister? ¿Cómo está? Nice people around here. Mm -hmm. Got any idea what time it is? Sorry, I, I don't know. Yeah, no problem. Take care now. Bye.
Buenos días, señor. Good work, pal. And how are you doing today? Good morning, sir. Good morning. You stop! This is the law. Screw the law to you. Good morning, you. <laughs> Shit! No! You ain't gonna walk out of this town alive. Come on, please. I didn't take much. No, no! What happened? Looks like he's worse for wear. Okay, off you go then. have any. And if you did, I bet none of you would share. Madam? Jimmy! Is Jimmy here? Have you seen Jimmy, tough guy? Can't say that I have. Well, when you see him, punch him for me, will you? Bloody little man's late with my cocaine. So, what did it be? I'm not one to gossip, but I'm now, this is a meal. Won't be the last time, neither. My God! Yeah, what, what is wrong with all of you? Good meal, I hope. You're, you're, you're dull! Dull, dull, dull. I bet you all vote. Oh, I bet you all care! Oh, there's nothing worse than caring. Caring hurts. I don't want to hurt. I want to drink and inject cocaine. Devour virgins whole. Mm -hmm. Usual sort of stuff. Monsieur? I drank too much. I'm told the savages are giving businesses a terrible time up north. Ah. They keep talking about giving us the vote. Can I get a hot bath, too? Je veux une salle de I want to be a queen. Voting is demeaning. Je veux une salle That's what's wrong with this country. Too many bloody rights and given to entirely the wrong people. We need another war. Hello, ma'am. Oh, hey, good looking. I, I am in a good mood for some reason. That's what I like to hear. Well, I'll leave you to it. So long now. You need some help in here? Maybe another time. All right, you go ahead. Government build is on fire. Here, there's packs of sand. I'm not sure what they, hmm. they think they'll Thanks, mister.
Hello. Come on, pal. Saludos. I know you. Mr. I believe we've met. We have. At that ghastly party. Oh, Evelyn Miller. Unfortunately so, Mr. Arthur Morgan, at least sometimes. Uh, can I say something rude? Sure. The mayor thinks you robbed him. Well, uh, to be clear, he, he wasn't very upset about it. He rather liked you. Okay. Do you, uh... Well, I mean to say, uh, can you steal things? Is there a reason you're asking me to incriminate myself, Mr. Miller? Well, I'm sorry. Have you met? Uh, this is Rain's Fall, a great chief, and his son, Eagle Flies. Gentlemen, yeah, we saw you in the wagon train crossing the river at Cumberland Falls. And at the party, you were upstairs. <laughs> you have great powers of observation. As my people, if we are even a people anymore. We've fought hard. We've made peace treaties, and those treaties were broken. And we've been moved and punished and punished and moved. I'm sure. And now I am told we are to be moved again. Clearly contravening the peace treaty signed three years ago. This will lead to war. No, my son, it will not. We cannot fight another war. They have got stronger. And we have become far weaker, Mr. Morgan. Well, it's a bad business. It's to do with oil. I know it is, but I need the proof. I believe there were some prospectors who were on their land a few months ago who have filed reports with Leviticus Cornwall and the state government claiming huge reserves of oil under their land. So, you want me to try and steal it? Obviously, they can't. <laughs> and even more obviously, I would be useless. <clears throat> Listen, I realize that it is a ridiculous request, but we're very desperate. Now, I'm not a do-gooder, Mr. Miller. Gentlemen, I'm very sorry for your predicament, but I'm a working man. I got problems of my own. We will pay you very handsomely, Mr. Morgan. How much? I told you, they're all mercenaries. <laughs> There's a price on my head in two states, my friend. The government doesn't like me any more than it does you. Like you, I've been running for as long as I can remember. And like you, my time here is nigh undone. We understand, and we will pay. Thank you. You meet my son in a couple of days near Citadel Rock, just west of the oil fields. Okay. We are very grateful for your help. Gentlemen, that appointment with the Senator. We should head over there. It's a waste of our time. And his. We must try everything. Come along. Hello, Mr. Miller. The counselor wants to apologize. He can see you now. We've been waiting I don't know how long. Or next month, if you'd like to reschedule. Come. Perhaps the Senator won't mind waiting. Yeah.
Deputies let a fella out. of safety in nature. Take a pamphlet, please. I want you to be safe. Monsieur? Tell me. It's time to be saved. It's time Hi there, to folks. be safe. You, Bonjour, one of you, monsieur. please, Bonjour. take a pamphlet. Hey, mister. Hello, sir. Can I interest you in Chelonianism? Uh, I don't know. Can you? Well, I hope so. It is a fascinating religion that was taught to a very wise master about a hundred years ago in a land not very far from here. Take a book, please. Okay. You've made a wonderful choice. It is a religion of safety. A religion made by gods who understood what life is, not what life is could be, but what it is. And it is very dangerous. But with Chelonianism, it can be safe. Well, it's all in this book. Uh, am I boring you? Uh, a little. I'm sorry. Have a wonderful day. Hear the truth and rejoice, for you are saved and already in paradise. If only you had the wisdom to understand it. Chelonia, America, they are the same thing. If savages could prosper here, how much better shall the white man do in this sacred place? No more kings! We are all kings! Our prophet told us this 100 years ago. It's not as delicious a rumor. Hi, uh, ma'am. Bonjour. Do you want to be safe? The answer is in Chelonianism. Boy. Bien, bonjour.
Won't take long, boy. Yep, yep. What? Come on.
Evening. Come here, Arthur. You know. Oh, hello. Not the best quality, but some seasoning will hide it. Thank you, Arthur. Good evening, Arthur. There he is. Evening, Arthur. Evening. Hi there. Have a nice evening. Evening, Arthur. Everything okay? Always. Just checking. Okay. Good evening. I'm good. Karen. You look well? Thank you, Arthur. This air must be doing you good. All right, Arthur. Hi, Reverend. Very bad. 